So the next thing that I want to talk about is data types. So data types uh, in Python or data types are very important in programming because you can use data type to store various or different kind of data. For example, if I want to store numbers or strengths or Boolean expression, that's true or false or float, I will need that data type to do that. So to create, or we can look at the various data types in, there are a lot of data types in Python, but the common ones that we'll talk about are strings, integers, floats, booleans, and complex. So to create a string or st string variable uh, data types are simply text. Okay, so let me do this. So string which is equal to I am a string. So basically you wrap uh, quotes, either double quotes or single quotes around strings, just like in any other programming. So this is a string data type. So this is a string data type. All right. Then to create integers, or integers are just numbers. So let me say number is equal to two. So basically, just like in any other programming language, you don't wrap uh, numbers with quotes. Okay, then we can also have the float data type let's say 1.2 this is a float or let's say 1.20 we can also have let's say float float 2 which is equal to 0 0.5 okay Okay, so in Python, Boolean data types refers to true or false. <coughs> and to create a Boolean, we can have, let's say, A is equal to 5. Print into brackets. A is greater than 5. Let's see the output. So this gives false because A is equal to five. So if I print A is greater than five, definitely I'll get false, which is uh, the correct Boolean. Okay, let me print A is equal to five. So this gives an error because A it's an invalid argument. So to do to get this, I need to add this. Okay. So why we got an error is when you use a single equal sign, it means you are assigning a var uh, you are assigning a value to a variable. But to check whether a is equal to five, I need to use double equal signs. Okay. So that's why we got an error. So basically, this is how we can also create Boolean data types. Okay. So we can print. Uh, so assuming that we want to check the kind of data type for uh, the, the types above, we can do this by printing the data type. Okay. So to print a data type, all that we need to do is we just have to use the type the type uh, the type method or function in python so print into brackets type then you call let's say string all right so now if i print this the data type for the first 
variable is what string okay let's check for number right so this is an int or integer data type so 2 is an integer data type let me check for float okay so this is a float float are numbers with decimal points then we can also so these are just variable names it can be any any uh, variable or any name <coughs> so let's say my float all right so if i want to check the kind of data type i can use this print type uh, float my float to know the kind of data type okay so basically these are uh, the common data types in python all right